Good evening and welcome to the 2020 graduation ceremony. My name is Peyton Irwin and I am MacArthur Student Council President. I will be tonight's Director of Ceremonies. Please rise and remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. This is Curtis Maxwell Whip. DeVell Thompson. And welcome to the MacArthur Middle School Class of 2020 8th grade graduation ceremony. Please rise to join us for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We are MacArthur, one district, one team, one mission. Go Generals! Please remain standing for the Star Spangled Banner, which will be played by our school band. by presenting Ricardo Herrera, who is this year's Student of the Year recipient, as well as the National Junior Honor Society Outstanding Achievement Award recipient. Ricardo will be welcoming you to tonight's graduation ceremony. Good evening, family, friends, teachers, administrators, school board members, and fellow graduates. I am Ricardo Herrera, MacArthur Sky recipient and I have the privilege tonight of welcoming you to the Class of 2020 Commencement of Douglas A. MacArthur Middle School. This evening is a special evening that marks our achievement over the past nine years. It is a big step towards our future educational endeavors, and we, the Class of 2020, are excited and grateful to be here. On behalf of my fellow graduates, I would like to take this time to extend a special thanks to all school board members, administrators, teachers, staff, parents, relatives, and guests for joining us on this special occasion. Your presence tonight means the world to us. You believed in us and now we've made it. Without you, our happiness would be incomplete. It is your presence that makes all the difference. Thank you for your support throughout the years and for being here tonight. This has been an unforeseeable year and your guidance has helped us to succeed. As we have persevered through these unprecedented times, we would like to stream this year's ceremony to all to enjoy. Thank you. Thank you, Ricardo. At this time, the assistant principal, Mrs. Heather Cassidy, will be presenting the Presidential Academic Fitness Awards. Good evening, families, Board of Education, and especially our 2020 graduates. My name is Mrs. Cassidy. I'm the assistant principal at MacArthur Middle School, and I will be presenting the Presidential Academic Fitness Award. The Presidential Academic Fitness Award recognizes students that show outstanding educational growth, improvement, commitment, or intellectual development in their academic subjects. Its purpose is to encourage and reward students who give their very best effort, often in the face of special obstacles. Faculty consider activities in which a student demonstrates high motivation, initiative, integrity, intellectual depth, leadership qualities, and or exceptional judgment. At this time, I am pleased to announce that the Presidential Fitness Award will go to the following recipients. 
Congratulations to all graduates of 2020. Thank you, Mrs. Cassidy. Next, we'll have Ms. Jennifer Barr present the Daughters of the American Revolution Award. The Daughters of the American Revolution Award is a monetary award which recognizes individuals who possess the qualities of dependability, service, leadership, and citizenship in their home, school, and community. This award is given to one boy and one girl selected by their teachers because they demonstrate the qualities to an outstanding degree. Congratulations to this year's recipients of the Daughters of the American Revolution Award, Carlos Martinez and Angelina Cucuchillo. Thank you, Ms. Barr. At this time, we'll have Mrs. Danielle Pruden present the American Legion Award. My name is Danielle Pruden and I am presenting the American Legion Award. This award is the counterpart of the DAR Award and recognizes individuals who possess the qualities of courage, honor, leadership, patriotism, scholarship, and service. They are among the young people which will make them citizens of the highest type. American Legion School Award is given to the boy and to the girl who are deemed most worthy of the high qualities of citizenship and Americanism. The following award goes to Moises Gamino and Oriana Walton. Congratulations. Thank you, Mrs. Pruden. Next, we'll have Mr. David DeMasi present the Fran Morado Memorial Award. The Fran Morado Award is a monetary award presented to an eighth grade male and female student who has demonstrated outstanding academic accomplishments by the Berkeley Education Association. This year's winners are Justin Grace and Hermione Johnson. Congratulations to the two of you. Thank you, Mr. DeMasi. At this time, we'll now have Mrs. Nancy Corsello present the Glenn T. Slitch Ding Award. The winners of the Glenn T. Slitch Ding Award are Adriana Arias Diaz and Carlos Valdez. This award carries no monetary value, but is prestigious. Named for the former principal of MacArthur, this award is bestowed to one female student and one male student that has shown the greatest academic gains and maturation during their tenure at MacArthur. The John Philip Sousa Award was created with the approval of Helen Sousa Albert and Priscilla Sousa, daughters of the famous composer and bandmaster. It was introduced in 1955 to honor the top student in the concert band. The John Philip Sousa Award is the pinnacle of achievement and recognizes superior musicianship and outstanding dedication. I'm proud to announce that this year's winner of the John Philip Sousa Award is Emily Rodriguez. I now present you Ms. Tamara Irwin, who will be presenting the Parent Teacher Association Award. Good evening. My name is Ms. Irwin. I am presenting the PTA Awards. The Sunnyside and MacArthur Parent Teacher Association issues a voluntary award to a male and female with the highest GPA and class grades. Please join me in congratulating this year's recipients for the 2020 graduating class, Emily Rodriguez and Ricardo Herrera. Congratulations on a job well done. Thank you, Ms. Erwin. Now our 2020 valedictorian, Emily Rodriguez, will come forward to impart the reflections of the class of 2020. Welcome parents, relatives, friends, teachers, staff, Dr. Bresnahan, district administrators, and District 87 Board of Education. I am Emily Rodriguez, 
and have the honor of being this year's valedictorian. Tonight, I also have the privilege of imparting memories from my time spent here at MacArthur as I reflect on the class of 2020. Throughout our three years at MacArthur Middle School, our teachers have been preparing us for this day. And today, we have proven that we are ready for the next step of our lives, high school. When first attending MacArthur, we had only a basic idea of what to expect. New teachers, new friends, and new schedules. However, some of the unexpected moments are what we remember most from our time at MacArthur. Being at MacArthur General has been a challenging yet immensely gratifying experience. Our teachers have prepared us well for our future. They have taught us to avoid conflicts, put effort into everything we do, and make mature decisions. Above all, they taught us to enjoy life and be our own selves in all that we do. This has proven that there are no limits to what we can accomplish. We shall never forget the many tasks we had to do, including challenging analytical writing assignments. The multiple essays in ELA were difficult to keep up with, but proved to be quite simple by the end of the year. Throughout their many research projects completed this year in social studies, technology provided a helping hand for us to be successful. Although challenging, we will always have a special connection to math because of the way we experienced and learned new concepts. The enthusiasm of our teacher and hands-on experiences in science always made us wish to come back for more knowledge. Our teachers inspired us to become lifelong learners. We will always have fond memories of our years spent here at MacArthur. We have spent a large amount of time throughout these halls, both during and after school. We have built many friendships and spread our different cultures throughout this building. The student body, although not always perfect, had a special bond with several teachers. There have been many teachers during our years at MacArthur that have been there for us. We will miss them dearly in this new path we have made for ourselves. While we don't know much about what our future holds, we know one thing for certain. There are uphill battles and downhill pitfalls. We will always have our MacArthur teachers to lend us a helping hand in high school and beyond. Today, we pass a milestone in our life, graduating middle school. We will not forget the people who made it possible for us to be here today, our parents and our teachers. Our parents have worked hard to help us with all that school has required. The acts, such as a simple drop off at the front entrance or their support of us during practice was much needed and greatly appreciated. The motivation from the adults in the building continued to welcome us daily. Our teachers have always made themselves available to assist us with any needs we may have had. We must acknowledge them for helping us get to this point today. Although we may have sad faces, we graduate with warm feelings and fond memories. So thank you to our parents and our teachers for being there when we needed you most. It's difficult for many of us to say goodbye. We must not think of this day as the end, but rather the beginning of a new chapter of our lives. The years to come will prove to be more special than the years in our past. These moments we now cherish are simply the building blocks to our future. There is still so much more to come. We move forward with many friendships, lasting memories, and amazing opportunities to make the most of our lives. The world never stops moving, so neither will we. Our future is in close sight and brings many new endeavors. Today is our day. Congratulations, class of 2020. We did it. Best wishes to my classmates, and thank you. Thank you, Emily. I will now be welcoming Dr. Carmen Blakely, who will be addressing the graduating class of 2020. Good evening, parents, family members, members of the Board of Education, Dr. Bresnahan, District Administrators, distinguished guests, District 87, teachers and staff, and a very special good evening to the class of 2020. I am Dr. Kermit Blakely, the proud principal of MacArthur Middle School, home of the generals. I want to express my sincere and humble gratitude to parents, guardians, and family members who played a vital role in the success of your child. As a principal, I have met many of you and you've been a guiding light to me and to our school. Thank you for your hard work and congratulations to each of you. Our school honors, respects, and celebrates the parents, guardians, and the class of 2020. At MacArthur Middle School, there are no big eyes or little U's. We are one team with one mission. That is the model we live by at MacArthur Middle School. And that is the model which the class of 2020 has achieved success. The class of 2020 can be described as a very passionate, 
resilient and resolute class that cares deeply for learning for one another, the teachers, staff, and families. From this care for one another and those relationships, our graduates will continue to grow and achieve academic greatness. We are extremely proud and salute each and every one of you. There's a quote that says, the difficult we do immediately and the impossible takes a little while longer. I wanna share with you that nothing is impossible for the class of 2020. If they say it's impossible, maybe it's impossible for them, but it's not impossible for you. From those words, I challenge each of you to be great. No matter what your passion or future goals, selling for being good is not an option. The only option is to be great. Be the best you that you can be. Graduates, don't ever, don't ever let anyone tell you what you cannot do. You're in the control of your dreams and your goals. Whatever you put in, you will get out. Believe in yourself, stay committed and motivated throughout the journey. Graduates and guests, we all are in this game of life together as one team. Graduates, you are all superstars, champions in our eyes. We are your biggest fans. You have accomplished much and you will continue to achieve great feats. We are confident you, that you will continue to be leaders throughout high school and beyond because generals lead. We will miss each of you individually and especially as a whole. We are one team. We will have one mission, and that mission is complete. I now present to you the class of 2020. Thank you, Dr. Blakely. I would now welcome and introduce the superintendent of School District 87, Dr. Terry Bresnahan. On behalf of the Board of Education and the administration of School District 87, I want to extend our congratulations to the MacArthur Class of 2020. I would first like to take a moment to thank all of the parents, family members, and friends who have supported our graduates on their journey here. To our graduates, I would like to thank each of you for all of your determination, hard work, and perseverance during extremely challenging times. The celebration of your time in District 87 cannot be captured in a single ceremony. So while I know we are all saddened to not watch you walk across the stage and be handed your diplomas, this moment does not define you. You are a truly remarkable class who will be stronger than ever for what you have sacrificed. As you reflect on the years you have spent with us, I hope you remember the successes you have achieved, the trials you have overcome, and the many bonds you have created with one another. Our greatest pride is seeing our graduates return to share their successes. This is more important than ever. We look forward to the day when you can return and share all that you have accomplished. We see the greatness in each of you and are so very proud. We miss you more than you know and welcome the time when we can reunite to celebrate together. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Thank you, Dr. President Han. Mr. Kane and Mr. Ramos will now read the names of the members of the graduating class of 2020. Arlene Aceves. Denise Adams. Adriana Arias Diaz. Winter Austin. Kalia Blue. Valeria Batista. Tamira Bell. Dulce Bravo. Megan Brown. Angelina Acuchiolo. Jennifer Calzada Espedola, Rihanna Campbell, Jordan Cooper, Valeria Covarubias, Diamond Crump, Hillary Cruz Granados, Takayla Dilworth Vaughn, Liliana Vivar Esquival, 
Ulysses Fierro, a star fry, Warik Ginba, Alexandra Gonzalez Garcia, Desaya Hardy, Madison Haynes, Catherine Fernando Herrera, Oscar Herrera, Ricardo Herrera, Jayla Hunt, Peyton Irwin, Amber Jimenez, Harmony Johnson, Aaliyah Jones, Amaya LaSalle, Iman LaSalle, Ruby Liscom, Andrea Martinez Ayala, Carlos Martinez, Jaden Miller, Shamante Milner, Natalie Morales, Solianis Reyes Fernandez, Alyssa Rodriguez, Emily Rodriguez, Alejandro Salinas, Christopher Smith, Moses Smith, Bernard Spate, Marvin Stevens, Jacqueline Tekaweiwe, Carlos Valdez, Oriana Walton, Zachary Webb, Trishan Wiley Temple, Dante Williams, Javion Woods, Desmond Addison, Achilles Adalbe, Abraham Adalbe, Elias Alexander, Misael Alvarez, Victor Alvarez, Noemi Artiega, Julius Arzuaga, Corey Brown, Alexander Calderon, Oriya Caldwell, Jeremiah Campbell, Landon Carney, Litsi Carreno, Deja Coleman, Raul Contreras, Nadira Contreras, Omari Copeland, Mayona Kosi, Brandon Crum, Anthony Cruz, Brandon Curry, Ania Davis, Alexander Denton, Kyrie Dooley Whitaker, Cody Duncan, Cesar Estrada, Nolan Farmer, Jesus Flores, Manuel Flores, Joshua Galindo, Moises Camino, Christian Garcia, Eric Garcia, Sarah Garcia, Jaden Gatsi, Alejandra Gomez, David Gomez, 
Karina Gomez. Ashley Gonzalez Evangelista. Justin Grace. Corey Green. Eric Garrido. Romina Guzman. Kamaya Hughes. Jordan Hunter. Landon Hunter. Jesus Jacobo. Soraya Jarowski. Shaman Johnson. Walter Johnson. Curtis Knox. Rebecca Leon. Reina Lopez. Lene Lowry. Camila Lutero. Tamara Marcos. Jasmine Martinez. Priscilla Martinez. Mario Medina. Bailey Mills. Makai Moore. Tony Mora. Antonio Morgan. Noe Munoz. Alexander Perez. Kiwan Pettis. Karen Pimento. Nicholas Powell. Andres Ramirez. Kanan Reddit. Kalia Reed. Khalil Ringo. Colin Robinson. Kylie Rocha. Leali Rodriguez. Anthony Santiago. Destiny Serrano. Taylor Shavers. Demicia Singleton. Ruben Tavizan. Emily Turan. Dominic Thomas. Devel Thompson. Oriana Torres. Aliyah Towns. Sophia Trujillo. Jordan Tucker. Eileen Velez. Fred Varens Simomega. Andrea Vasquez. Edgar Villarreal Luchega. Mariah Wells. Kevon Wilkerson. Anton Williams. Kennedy Williams. Eduardo Wint. William Wolnick. Gracia Zumaya. Thank you, Mr. Kane and Mr. Ramos. I would now like to invite our 2020 salutatorian, Jaden Miller, to give the acknowledgement and farewell. Good evening. My name is Jaden Miller, and on behalf of the class of 2020, I would like to thank the school board members, district administrators, teachers, and staff. A special thank you to administrators and all of the teachers for encouraging us and giving us the push we need to succeed. We will never forget what you did for us or what you have taught us over the years. We will never forget the effort you put into giving us a great education. We really appreciate your help and guidance. Thank you. 
Congratulations to the class of 2020. We have worked hard and achieved our goal. As we head in different directions and attend different schools next year, I wish you all the very best in your future goals. Achieve the goals you set your mind to and you will succeed in life and go far. I hope nothing but the best for all of the graduating class. Finally, we would like to thank our parents, guardians, grandparents, relatives, and our guests for being here tonight. We wouldn't be as successful without your guidance and support. On that note, thank you to everyone for attending the graduation ceremony and congratulations to the MacArthur Class of 2020. Thank you, Jaden. I now present to you the MacArthur Graduating Class of 2020. <laughs> Thank you.